ways to start figuring out what you want to do with your life. Um, I find that a lot of people, when you ask them what they want, they have no idea. And, okay, that's cool. If you want to want to know what you want to do, um, if you have any interest in exploring what you might want to do, here's a couple of ideas that I have for you. Um, first, start paying attention to things that you want at all. Like, something that you're completely certain of that you want. It could be a chocolate craving. I don't care. Like, go small. What do I want? I want comfort. I want a hug. I want anything, okay? Just something that you're, like, completely and totally sure of. So that's step one, all right? Uh, two, you can start acting on those things. And three, you can start doing the extractory process of what don't I want. When you're sure, like, really sure you don't want something, start playing that game if you if you don't feel drawn to the game of, of what do I want. You can say, uh, what don't I want? I am I really don't want that. I don't want that. And start exploring that a little bit. Um, just a fair warning. Uh, you may find out the things that you are most vehement about not wanting are actually the things that you want that you're just scared of. But they have your best chance for growth. But you can start somewhere. Right? Asking yourself the question at all is a really great start. Um, and so, you know, just kind of go from there and see what happens. Um, and then I'd like you to start trying to pay attention to what you get drawn to. Um, I am drawn to this. I've always wanted to do that. How often do you hear people say that I've always wanted to do X, Y, Z, and they've never done it? Um, go do something. If you always wanted to take guitar lessons, like, make it happen. Even if you only take, like, a week, start. Like, make a phone call. Like, there's a really thing, that like, one of the things Kyle sees, um, had us do at the, the weekend thing that I attended was to actually do something concrete about whatever your goals are because it's really easy to get really hyped up and excited about what you're gonna do oh I'm gonna do this thing it's gonna be so great but if you don't take action in that moment of, of hypeness you're probably not going to do anything about it so you know buy that domain name for that website you want to do go um, make a phone call or put it in your calendar to make a phone call like legit plan something to set some action up um, so you can get the ball rolling um, but the first thing is to actually start asking yourself whether or not you actually want to do the things that you're doing. Um, and then once you start figuring that out, your next choice is to decide if you want to actually do anything about it. Um, but I hope that you realize that you can, and I love you, and...